I'm out of focus. <laughs> Good start. Hi, this feels so weird. Hello everyone, it's Chloe here. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another makeup related video, which I have not done in forever. It's been quite a shit show of a couple months. I'm finally sitting down for a sit down video. I feel like I haven't done a sit down video. Mine's like my haul videos, I guess. Does that count? I don't know. I'm actually sitting down to film a makeup tutorial. Well, not really a tutorial. I'm just going to put some makeup on because I haven't in a very, very long time. I thought I'd film it and just chat to you guys, have a bit of an update. Maybe we'll play some tunes. I'm not sure. However, right now it is Easter. So obviously when I upload this, it's not going to be Easter, but I hope you guys had a safe Easter period. And if you don't celebrate, I hope you had a really good long weekend because it's holidays. <laughs> Regardless of that, today I'm going to put some makeup on, like I said, and we're going to try and make it look good. The last time I did a full face was when I went to the Wiggles with my girls and that was the start of March. It is now the middle of April. It's been over a month and a bit since I put a full face on and for me that's a pretty long time because obviously with me filming and stuff I always usually have a full face on so it's kind of weird to not actually do makeup for a while but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna zoom in probably a little bit because actually maybe not because I'm gonna start with my face. So if you guys want to know whatever happens in this video just keep on watching. One, two, three, let's switch this up. Would you believe me if I just told you I whacked my camera like four times trying to do a TikTok intro? Because I did. Okay, I've zoomed you in a little bit just because I am going to work my face first. So, if you're new here, hello. My book is so dirty. Ew. Yuck. I've read like so many books in the past month actually no i won't say month no. uh, this is my like fourth book in a row which is crazy to me anyway that's the point we are going to start with my face now because i'm not going anywhere i'm not going to prime or anything i would usually prime keep that in mind would i though but i'm doing a pink look today because i'm going to be wearing a green dress just to like make myself feel good and pink and green are my thing now you guys should know that if you haven't realized my skin is hating me um this massive ass fucking planet on my freaking cheek uh, it was fine and then i found this new thing for my anxiety is to pick my skin if anyone has genuinely this is not a joke if anyone has any recommendations on how to stop me picking my skin that would be great because i never used to minus my nails obviously these have always been like a picking territory but like my face and especially like my ankles i've been picking the shit out of so like if you could just like help me out help a girl out with some anxiety ridden pickingness <laughs> is that even a thing anyway i'm gonna cover this bad boy there's like pimples on my nose it is gonna be a fun time are we ready because i'm not mentally do i have a green concealer if you are new to a makeup tutorial and you haven't seen me do my makeup that was my wall i'm trying to move backwards my makeup tutorials i leave everything linked down below so if you are interested you can just go down there to see what i'm using first of all i'm just going to grab a bit of green love me some green you guys know and i'm just going to cover the shit out of it <laughs> because it's a lot it's very i don't know why i'd never used to pick my skin i think now because obviously my mental health is very very bad you guys are not praising me but i like that you guys are liking how i'm talking about my mental health a lot of people it's still a very taboo is that, was that how you say it taboo if i'm leaning over it's because i want to see the mirror without the camera in the way i'm very sorry about that it's still a very touchy subject i'll say that um to talk about which i think it really shouldn't be that is my opinion however i am really happy to obviously talk about my mental health i am completely open i guess to talk about my mental health and if i'm having a break i'm gonna tell you guys i'm having a break due to my mental health but obviously i still want some things to be a little bit personal because it is me and i'm a very shy gal yeah anyway <laughs> Let's get some foundation. Go to. Why am I out of focus all the time? It's because my books are in the background, aren't they? If this background's too much, I'm not sure. Because again, I did a sit down kind of video with my uh, haul video. But I was kind of standing up. This is my first time sitting down for a video. I'm using my like mirror lighting. And this is the background. So I really hope it's okay. Anywho, I'm going to use the Revolution foundations. I love this stuff. I'm using two different colors because apparently I can't find an actual skin tone for me. Nothing new there. I also can't actually really see what I'm doing because I usually have a big mirror with me. Not this one that you guys normally see. I usually have like a, not a handheld one, but like a smaller one that I can like, you know what I mean? I don't know if you do. But um, somehow it got lost in the moving situation. So I need to find another one. Uh, for right now, I'm going to use my handheld one and hope for the 
best. So if everything looks like shit, we're just going to blame the fact that I can't actually see properly. Anyway, I'm just going to wipe this on my face. I don't really know what to talk about just because life has been mental, but I guess that's a lot to talk about, I guess. Not really. A lot of you guys are wanting weekly vlogs. They are coming. I am vlogging in the next week or so. Today is currently, what day is it? <laughs> Today is the 17th of April. As I said in the start, it is Easter right now. The 29th and the 30th are mum's birthday and Ebenezer's birthday. And Ebony's having her own little get together for her birthday, which I am going to, which is really exciting. Obviously, I'm a lot further out now. I'm three hours away from my friends. Oh, that's still very green, isn't it? I got to cover that shit like no tomorrow. So anytime I get an, a chance to obviously go down and see my friends, I'm going to take it. We're celebrating Ebenezer's birthday. It's not really good to talk and do your foundation, is it? So I'm going to vlog that. And I don't know if I'm going to vlog a lot because obviously her friends are going to be there. I'm not okay. I'm not sure if they're going to be okay with me filming. But hopefully I'm going to maybe film two videos today as I'm having my makeup on. So this video and another one. And then the vlog weekly vlogs will start. Just because I don't really know what I should be filming. Because there's not much to do here. I have mentioned that. Obviously I live in the country. I guess kind of where we used to live was country to some people. But realistically it was just like, what's the word? Regional Victoria. But we were on like the border order of it so realistically when it comes to like government we are country where we were but this is real country you know so there's not much to do here without someone noticing you like having a camera and filming you know what i mean so i don't like this town only has a thousand people and something like a thousand and forty people everyone knows each other there's this brand new family of four come into town it's gonna be a bit odd you know so i don't really want to put that on myself i don't think my mental health is up there right now to film in public here especially now that you know we're the newbies of the town i guess which is kind of scary when you think about it but when i go to melbourne and stuff i'm fine with filming because again melbourne is massive <laughs> foundation's on looking a bit better feeling a bit better i'm gonna put some concealer on I talk to you guys i think for me doing my face is really really quick like my face makeup foundation wise if you include like bronzer and stuff it's still pretty quick over the years i've gotten pretty quick at doing my makeup even though it takes me ages still everyone we, me and my friends always joke that it takes me forever but realistically if i had a time limit i could finish a full face in that time limit i just like to give myself time just in case some shit happens which most of the time that happens so i tend to take my time especially if i'm doing like a full face of like eyeshadow and like technical shit not sure how technical i'm gonna get in this video but we'll see but i haven't put a full face on so i feel like i really need to just glam myself up and feel good because this is what i used to do as a kid when i was feeling down and like bored about myself i would just play around with really shitty makeup put it on do a shitty look and i would feel 10 times better is that working now i don't know but i'm gonna try my best go back to my roots of me in my old house just chilling in front of a camera talking to you guys and you guys have mentioned to me a couple times actually that you missed the makeup videos and i miss doing them because i i started doing them that oh my god ew i started my channel doing them so i kind of miss doing it as well so I thought I would do a makeup related video because why not? Also breaks the ice I think because you can talk about really anything while you're doing your makeup. You can just talk shit doll. It's like on a FaceTime call. That's how I think of it anyway. Why am I doing that? That was stupid. The thing's not... You fucking idiot. I took the like the shaky thing off my powder because it's really, really empty and I just shook it everywhere. So that's good. I'm going to get my beauty blender. You guys really know what I do for my makeup anyway nowadays, but I'm obviously going to kind of talk to you guys about it because I haven't done it in a while. So I thought, why not? I'm just going to powder my entire face while I'm at it. I definitely look uh, more alive now. <laughs> I'm going to do my eyebrows now, and if you guys know me, you know I love my eyebrows. Like, they're a very big part of me. Which sounds weird, but I feel like everyone has something in their makeup routine that is massive for them. For me, that is my eyebrows. Now, I was very, very grateful enough to actually receive a couple of products from Benefit Cosmetics, which is insane, because, like, my 16-year-old self would be thriving right now. So I got the Goof Proof Brow Pencil and the Precise Brow Pencil and also the gel. Now, I haven't used the gel yet, so I'm going to use that today. And I also, which one have I used? I don't remember. Okay, I've used the Precise in my brow, but I haven't used the Goof Proof. I'm going to use most of that today, but I will obviously touch up with this. Usually, I kind of lean away from pencil brow products, I guess if that's what you want to call. Just because I want it to be very, very 
snatched. You know I'm a very snatched brow person. I'm not getting paid for this. They don't, didn't tell me to put this in a video. I just really want to try them. Apparently this has like little fibers or whatever to make it look like kind of like laminated brows, which I've always wanted to try. So we're going to try it out. If it doesn't really work out, I'll just get my ColourPop gel or whatever. This will probably be cut down a little bit because I want to obviously make it really precise, but I don't want to cut it out completely as I am using new products, I guess. So I'm just going to fill it out like normal. Ooh, hello. Oh, that matches perfectly. Did you see that? Look at that. Look at that line, bitch. <laughs> the top line is always good. It's the bottom one that never really goes well. That's pretty precise. <laughs> That's pretty spot on. Shit. All right. I didn't, I actually generally did not expect that. It feels good. Is that, is that weird that it feels good? <laughs> this is what it's like getting ready with me. I just talk to myself like I'm doing a makeup tutorial. I think everyone's been there though, so don't don't hate on me because everyone's been there. Okay, thank you. Now, this is my shitty eyebrow. Everyone has a shitty eyebrow. So let's see if we can get this matching, eh? Does that look the same? I don't actually know. I'm kind of sweating. They look pretty good. <laughs> like, considering they're very different shapes naturally, I think it's okay. I've been doing lunch with my up. Why is that? I was going to ask why that was in my head, but I literally am doing a TikTok to it. So, I guess that makes up for a day. Now, I'm going to blend the front of this. Also, excuse the fact that I have no nails on. I was talking about how I have been picking my skin. I broke all of my natural nails off. You guys know the last that I had were my natural nails. And I broke them off because my anxiety... We're not going to talk about it. I'm going to now set this in place with what is this called 24 hour brow setup this is fun i think it's clear there's no color to it and i oh, oh, whoa that's a funky little brush look at that okay how do i put that on my brow though <laughs> no that's not how you do it wait i'm confused did i wipe all the product off i think i wiped all the product off it smells nice oh that's already kind of set whoa that's kind of cool didn't they good enough for me i'm really close up <laughs> okay oh my god that's so fun thank you benefit for sending them out to me you didn't have to but i really do appreciate it trust me my 16 year old heart is thriving thank you very much i'm gonna spray my face with some setting spray before i start my eyeballs now i'm gonna do pink but every time i try and do pink i always somehow look like i'm ending up with pink eye or like a bruised eye which isn't really the way you want to go i don't really know what to talk about sorry i really just want to take photos of myself and feel good that's all i really want to do and that's okay my boobs are sweating you're allowed to get ready get glam if you keep hearing that banging noise i'm so sorry you're allowed to get glam and just take a bunch of photos photos how little photo shoot that's all you gotta do in life now <laughs> what do i do <laughs> do i do like a pink crease with like glitter now i'm trying to think do i go extra like read all about it extra i think i know what i'm gonna do do i though ah! this is exciting i have this eyeliner pencil so i'm gonna do my normal like creasy looks i always do i have to find an eyeshadow that matches this though so just give me a sec <gasps> oh i think i might have found one <laughs> hell yeah i think i'm gonna do the cut crease and then i usually just put eyeliner on and call it a day but i think i'm gonna put glitter on my lid just to add more emphasis and um, make myself really extra that's what i'm here for so this is the ColourPop cream gel eyeliner in insomniac that's fun my eyes are pretty okay i don't need to prime them or anything because i'm just using eyeliner i'm probably not going to talk during this because again i am probably going to shit my pants but i'm just gonna follow a line and like make a little bit of a whoop like i usually do i think i did a whole tour on this at christmas time i usually do this a lot oh my god that was exciting thought the power cut out for a minute <laughs> got it i've done this a couple times so it's kind of me like just repeating it but um i think i in the glitter type of shimmery i'll say shimmer i don't know if it's gonna be glitter or not to my lid will emphasis a bit and then put some liner on i'm gonna put this on hopefully it doesn't break this is a nice color oh it's it's fluoro. Okay, so I'm just gonna line it because I have hooded eyes. So I like doing this look because it makes me look like I'm more awake than I am. I think I'm gonna do two eyes at once just so they're even. That looks cool. I'm gonna just take it. Bye. These eyebrows look good though. <laughs> How we looking? I'm a little matter of focus anyway. You probably will see me this look next week because I want to film another video after this if I am up for it. So you're probably going to see this lovely look two weeks in a row. I think this one's going to be a bit stuffy. There's always one eye or one side of my face that looks worse than the other. Ooh! What was that? I look like a butterfly, but like not in a good way. This eye is bad. I think I have an idea with the shimmer. I'm just going to put it in the center just to add some spice. Kind of fucked this up a bit, but it's fine. We're going to work it out with some eyeshadow. Now I'm going to use the NYX Tutorials Beauty Bay palette. Is this it? I'm going to use Blend and Snap because that's what we're going to do together. Will I find a brush that's clean? 
No, because have I cleaned them? No. That's my jewelry making that noise, by the way. Sorry. So I'm just going to grab it and I'm going to put it basically right on top of the liner and just blend it up. This is a really fun way to add color into your life, especially if you don't want to go full on with an eyeshadow look. It's really fun. You can just add it to the inner corner and make it fine. Make it fine. That's English, but you get what I mean. Because everyone keeps asking how I got into color, but I really have just loved colored eyeshadow for a very long time. But this is much, like a lot easier to get yourself into it, if that makes sense. So I'm just going to blend right on top of that liner. So basically the liner was just like a line, obviously, but it matches pretty well. So it's not like obvious that I did the line, if that makes sense. I generally love this look so much. I do it so often and it probably hurts people's souls because I do it so many times. This is what makeup's all about, making you feel good. Good. I really should do the other eye. <laughs> So I'm going to do the same thing on this eye. Hopefully it will end up looking the same because this actual like eyeliner I did is bad. So hopefully I can fix it with the eyeliner. No, with the eyeshadow. Too many eye words. If not, I can always clean it up, but I really can't be bothered to do that. Do -do -do. How are we looking? Do I look like I've been <laughs> punched in the eye? Like in a nice way. Is there a nice way you punch in the face? I don't think there is. And if there is, they're lying to you because that is false. I don't know, this eye, maybe I'll just take photos from the left hand side. That's the right hand side, my right hand side. Well, wow. anyway, I'm just going to finish this off and then we can kind of clean it up a bit because I do know this is a bit messy. Maybe I'll just put highlighter on it and then make it better because highlighter makes everything better. My temple's itchy, which is not fun. It's a lovely pink though. You know what's so funny is I hated pink. I think if you probably look back at my old videos, which I really don't want you guys to do because it's embarrassing as hell but i probably have mentioned multiple times i don't like pink and here i am in my pink phase my pink and green phase mostly green though i'm gonna be honest pink just an added bonus here we are and i wasn't a fan of pink years ago but you know we change as humans so i guess that's a good thing change is good okay not too bad not too bad it's not gonna be perfect every goddamn time i do it but for the amount of times i've done it it should be perfect every time i do it so what i'm gonna do now is i think this is too shimmery actually is it <laughs> this is the morphe m124 i'm gonna grab the shade ivy in the exact same palette i'm not changing palettes or anything which is the highlighter shade i swatched here and i'm gonna put it in the center of my lid and then if it's too odd i'll do the whole lid but i have a feeling it might look good if i just do it up and down because it kind of has a pink tone to it which i kind of like see that looks kind of cool but then again it looks stupid i'm not sure i think i might do the other eye and we'll see but like that's with no base or anything that's just showing you how pigmented this goddamn eyeshadow is because bloody hell this palette is one of my faves. Does that look weird? Is the question I'm asking. I think maybe with eyeliner on it, it won't look too weird because the eyeliner will be very thick on this side. So I think we might be in the clear. But then again, I can always just add it where the eyeliner isn't because it's probably going to cover most of it anyway. So what I'll do now is my eyeliner really quickly. Well, not really quickly, but I'll try my best. <laughs> I think I need to buy another one of this because this is the holy grail. This is the Morphe Felt Tip Liquid Eyeliner in ink. I'm pretty sure you can have different colors. This is just a black one. I'm going to do my eyeliner like normal. And then hopefully I can fix this glitter up. Because I really like the glitter with this pink. It's really nice. So I'm going to do my eyeliner. And then I will hopefully come back with some even eyeliner. Or I'm going to cut to me being really upset with how bad it looks. Is that good? <laughs> See, with the liner, I think the shadow looks okay. Because my eyeliner is always thick. Even though I have hooded eyes, I know I shouldn't be doing thick eyeliner. But I like it. So I do it. I don't know if that's even. <laughs> Look at the different shapes already. What is that? How are we looking? I actually kind of like it. It's like my big lashes I always wear. I think I might be a look. Is that even? <laughs> it's definitely not. I think my pen's running out, which is not fun. Where's the lid? Scrum diddly umptious. Okay, what am I do just to spice it up a bit? I'm going to add the pink eyeliner to my waterline. Oh, whoa, that's bright. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna spice it up even more. I need to fix the eyeliner, but I've just covered it because I think it's running low. So give me a second. Kimchi palette. You know she will never disappoint. And I'm going to grab a pencil brush. This is the Jaclyn Hill Morphe brush in 40 and I'm going to grab the color on Kim Chi's world suit yourself which is black I'm gonna put that on my waterline because I am what crazy not my waterline 
my lower lash line. Wow. <laughs> I'm really proud of that little thing. I'm going to put it on there like I'm mental. Pink and black will always look so superior. I do apologize for this or my other mirror being in the way. It's just because I don't have anything to look at. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to put this all over, put my lashes on off camera and then come back and do my face. And then hopefully my lashes will look pretty with this look. And then we can start the face. I could do my lips, which I haven't done in so long. I haven't done lipstick in a while. And then we will finish off the look. Hi, so this is my final look on my eyes. The lashes, I'm running out of lash glue, so it's not the best, but I think the biggest decision of my life was to add in that glitter and I love it so much. So what I'm doing now is I'm gonna do my face. Now I thought we could play some music just because I feel like I've talked a bit much. <laughs> talked a bit much, is that English? I don't know. But these are my eyes, the lashes. I like always the Majestics from Supernova. Love them to death. And then we're going to do my normal face routine. I'm gonna get everything out like I usually would. And we'll play some tunes. Now I haven't done music on this channel in a while. So I may or may not get demonetized. We're gonna play some upbeat songs because I feel like if I play anything other than that, I'm just gonna get really depressed. This is the new Tate McRae song. I love this bitch with my passion. I have my whole heart. This girl is fantastic. This is kind of a sad song, but we're gonna get into it. All my products will be listed down below. Always don't stress. You want the girl with the small waist and the perfect smile. Hey. Out. Not possible. She said she's nothing to worry about. Don't be bored. So sad. She's got everything I don't have. Mood. She's out of my face. Out of my face. It's coming to get out. Say it out. She's got everything. Where's my brush? Oh, there. Okay, Gary. My face doesn't take that long when you talk about it. Like, when you talk about it, when you think about it, I guess. My top repeat, what is my top repeats? My body is covered in powder. That's the liked songs, Chloe, Jesus. I also changed my Spotify layout again. I leave, my Spotify is always linked down below, by the way. Don't stress. Um, wow. Okay, role models first. <laughs> Why? Okay, so we got role model, we got Omar, of course. Harry Styles, more Omar, more Omar. <laughs> Oh my god. I think we'll play one more song, but my face is now done and I'm going to do my lips. I haven't done lips in a while because every time I go out, I don't put lipstick on because we have to put masks on usually, especially like if me and the girls go out. When I last went out, we had public transport. You had to wear a mask, so I didn't put any lipstick on. And last time I went out, besides that, I had to go in a restaurant, which had to wear a mask. So I haven't done lipstick in a while. So if it's bad, let's not talk about it. Okay, thank you. But I'm going to do nude because that's the way to go, I think. So I'm going to tell you guys my products and then I will play a song. I think we're doing okay. These lashes just feel weird. I think I need a new pair, that's why. I think even when I'm wearing the green, it's gonna look so good. I'm so excited. Okay, lip liner all from Morphe, okay? Lip liner is in Sweet Tea. My lipstick is gonna be in Honey and my gloss will be Chill. But I'm gonna put all these on while I listen to this song because this song is an absolute beautiful song. That scared me when I first listened to it. I was like, shit. Boy. Wash away my sins, let them flow away. Oh, that's a move. Whoa. Wash over me, wash over me. This is my look. I did change the lip gloss color, by the way. This is in Freebird. I did change it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to I'll go off camera, get dressed or get changed, whatever. Fix my hair and then we'll come back and I will finish off the video for you guys. But this is the final look. I am kind of impressed with myself considering I haven't put makeup on in a while. I'm not gonna lie, we're looking cute. Okay, I gotta zoom you out a bit. What am I doing? I have to move this mirror, hang on. Now you can see me outfit. Look at me. The dress is from Princess Polly. Ow. <laughs> I hauled this in my last video. You can use code CB20 for 20% off. That's not the point of this video. The point of this video was doing my makeup and feeling cute. Guess what? I feel a bit cute. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's really, really fun to do because I haven't done a sit down video in general, but I haven't done a makeup tutorial in a very long time either. So I feel really, really good that I got around to doing this. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up for me. If you are new here, please subscribe. I make a video every single Thursday at 12 p.m. If you are interested, you can subscribe. If you want to know anything else, just leave a comment and I'll go back to you guys because I read every single comment, so don't worry. If you want to know what I used on my face and I didn't explain what I used on my face, everything will be listed down below, like always, as well as all my social medias and stuff like that will be linked down below as well. But that's pretty much it. Remember to spread love, I stay positive, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, everyone.